they just tore up the car and got everything, um, which was really sad. This van should be filled with holiday presents for children in need. Instead, it's empty after it was ransacked in the Lakeshore neighborhood this week. It, it well brought me to tears. The thief broke into the locked van, stealing every toy inside. It happened just hours after Deltrina Johnson had filled it with dozens of gifts. I, do, I would think anybody who would go in and say, mm, mm, let me just think about this. Maybe this isn't the car to rob. But to see people, I don't want to say necessarily heartless, but in such a state, it just, it made me really sad. Johnson is the executive director at Oak Center Cultural Center. She preps the annual giveaway, which normally helps around 300 families each year. Families that line up around the block to ensure that something's under the tree for their children. I grew up in New Orleans, and my mother had seven kids. And we were in that line. Somebody gave to us. And that's why I do this. Someone I remember as a child standing in line waiting to get a little bag of goodies. Since the break in, donations have been coming in, including from strangers like Mike, who brought a trunk full of toys but wanted to keep his good deed anonymous. To steal anything now, I guess. It's sad because I, I like kids. I don't have any kids myself, so I like to try to give back each year. But a week away from the big giveaway, Johnson still needs enough toys to help another 200 kids. A Christmas wish she hopes the community will help her grant. Well, I'm just elated knowing the fact that the response is going out. Anyone willing to help is asked to donate directly to the Oak Center Cultural Center online or in person. In Oakland, Valina Jones, NBC Bay Area News.